One of the things I'm really looking forward to in the future is having all my stuff hydrophobic. And hydrophobic means that it doesn't really like water. This stuff here is actually hydrophobic sand. This is sand that doesn't really like water too much. You don't find that very often. All the sand that's on the beach quite likes sand. It clumps together. You can build sandcastles out of it. But this stuff, uh, it doesn't like water at all. So when you pour it into a beaker of water, it all clumps together but underwater because it's hydrophobic. Because it doesn't like water but then as you put it back out it goes from being wet just to being dry that one more time and the real world application of something like this or hydrophobic things in general is that I would love for all of my stuff to be hydrophobic so if you spilled tomato sauce on your top then it would just roll right off if you drop your phone down the toilet it would still be covered in bacteria but it means that you would just take it back out and use it one more time. So hydrophobic things for the future is something that I really, really uh, am looking forward to. So if you want to find out more about futuristic materials, then check out Mark Champion's Sci Guide.